is Gwyneth Paltrow's head in this box? Probably not. I am here to show you the world's first wireless electronic mountain bike drivetrain. This is SRAM's new XX1 Eagle Access Group. What you see in this box here will cost you $2,000. Let's open it up and take a look. On top, there's a chain in the new rainbow colors that celebrates SRAM's multiple world championships. The controller, a battery, a mini tool, and one of the cranks with dub axle. This group set is only available with SRAM's oversized dub axle. This is called the discrete clamp. If you're not using SRAM's matchmaker, which integrates the shifter into the brake lever, you'd use this to mount the shifter to the bars. Also included with the kit underneath the chain is the battery charger and a USB cable for the battery charger. You can actually charge the battery by plugging it into your computer. Second tier, we have the derailleur itself, the drive side crank arm, and a chain gap gauge for setting up the system. On the very bottom, we have the world famous Eagle cassette. The other part of SRAM's access ecosystem is the new reverb access post. This is a wireless version of RockShox's very popular, very familiar reverb dropper post. The reverb access uses the same battery as the access drivetrain. So if you're on the trail and the battery starts to wear out, you can swap to get yourself home. The reverb controller is styled a lot like the Eagle Access shifter and actually works on the same clamping system, including SRAM's integrated matchmaker clamps. Like the Access drivetrain, this is more expensive and heavier than its mechanical drop version. This post is $800, which is about $450 more expensive than the hydraulic reverb dropper post. SRAM hasn't given up on high-end mechanical drivetrains. They say they're going to continue developing their Eagle at the XX1 and XO level. If you're curious about how prices and weights compare, the Access Group is about $450 more expensive and about 100 grams heavier than the XX1 Eagle Mechanical Shift Group. The Access Shifter works a little differently than SRAM's Mechanical Shifter. The paddle is more of a rocker. You press on one edge to shift the chain one direction and the other edge to shift the chain the opposite direction. You can also customize the shifter's function in SRAM's Access app. Battery life is about 20 hours, give or take, and recharging is just a few hours. You bolt on the shifter, you bolt on the derailleur, and you're good to go. There's no cables or housing to run through the frame. There's no cable tension to set. It's just bolt it on, pair it, and you're out the door. It's also more precise and more consistent than the mechanical shift drivetrain. SRAM's Eagle Access Group is rolling out two versions. It comes in XX1 Eagle, which you see here. This is $2,000. The X01 Eagle Group is $100 less, and that one's a little heavier because of materials differences. SRAM is not selling the individual components yet. Those parts will be available later, so if you have an existing Eagle-equipped bike, you're gonna have to wait because all you need is the controller and the rear derailleur to upgrade to access. If you wanna have the coolest bike at the trailhead, you're definitely gonna want this group on your bike.